What is up, guys? Jerry333. I'm eating an orange. I don't eat bad all the time. Just most of the time. So, here it is. Just freshly peeled. We've got all the peelings right here. And it's shied out. I'm trying to get this middle part out. There we go. Perfection. Let's try it. Mmm. Mmm. So, did you guys know that if you put a gram of the sun, or whatever the sun is made out of, because nobody really knows, besides it's hot as shit, if you put a gram, a gram of sun right here on the earth, anywhere, any state, like by the water, it would destroy the whole earth, basically. It would not exist <laughs> like it would, like it is right now. Um, that's a gram of the sun. There's also those other things, um, like density. The most dense thing I can think of right now would be like lead or something, and uh, there's things that are so dense. That if you get, okay, so you know the earth, right? The earth is floating on nothing. It's just floating in the dark matter. But the earth mass is what is, has, has the, the moon there, right? M moving around the earth. The, the gravity from the earth and the moon put in the right place, right there where it is, has, and it's uh, moving around the, the earth, right? The gravity from the earth is having the moon in place there. So, if you get something this that's very dense, I believe it creates a black hole uh, if it's because it's so dense that it's just sucking in time space and the fabric of it of stuff of any uh, of everything that is physical into it. That's how you, I think that's how you create a black hole. And it's just um, because the gravity or the weight of something, that's what it creates gravity, the, 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 the mass of something. But something that is massive or big doesn't have to look big or be big. What I mean by that is, let's say this orange, right? It weighs not even a pound. It weighs, uh, you know, like nothing, a gram, right? But if it's made out of lead... It would weigh, the same orange would weigh a lot, maybe like a pound or two. Well, lead weighs more than, um, you know, uh, stainless steel or whatever. So, if you get that and you compact it into a small ball, it's smaller, but it still weighs more than this. Okay, like, okay, this. The same size this is very light, but if I put this, if this was lead, it would be like maybe five to six times, even though it's the same mass size. That's what I'm saying. So, you can get something that weighs as much as the earth in this size. You, now, now you understand what I'm getting at. And if you put it right here, it would create and distort reality. What I mean by that is distort reality. Uh, that's time space, and it could it could do different things. Uh, one of which is to create it could create a black hole and just suck her in. And there's also um, white holes, and I think white holes push things out of. It. So everything is kind of like a balance thing, right? Boy, girl, sun, moon. Uh, God, Satan, stuff like that. So the last clip with the oranges, that was from yesterday.
All right, guys, so I'm on my way back home. I'm feeling really hungry, or moderately hungry at least. So, um, gonna get something to eat. I don't know if I should get something to eat at home, or or what did you guys think? Let me know in the, the in the comment section. Making some sandwiches. Two slices of bread. We're gonna need some cheese. Some organic leaves. Homegrown. Some mayonnaise, mayo de mayo. Uh, I'll put the leaves on the mayo that way. Uh, that way, it's good for you, you know. And uh, cheese. Cheese me, Polly. Cheese me. We got venison. Venison. It's deer meat. Oh yeah, it's deer meat. It's deer meat. You just scoot down. What are we gonna do about this? This treachery. We're gonna make videos. Jim broke ice. He broke ice and uh, it's war. It's, um, let's make a little video about Jim. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. Some fresh butter. So, you're gonna hit a workout? Yeah, I'm gonna bench. No! <laughs> bench. Oh, bench. oh, yeah. Push up some little sprinkles. You little chips? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good, that's good. I just wanted to get a little serving dog. Yeah, Jimmy's been posing some bullshit about us, so 
We need to post some stuff on it. Yeah. Have you ever been in jail? We've been in city. Can we, is there like a picture of him in gym? Like, <laughs> no one? <laughs> I'm sure there is floating around somewhere. I've never been able to find it. So I saw a video, man, and it's weird. They got this technology, uh, basically, it's like time travel technology through the looking glass. And for some reason, after the whole movie, Alice in Wonderland, derived from what was derived from the, the white rabbit represents time they send children through this wormhole because for them it's easier for some reason uh -huh. they don't reject it and then they come out like at a different place in time but that you can also use this tech to see into the future as a mirror as a looking glass to see into the future it has a little cube in it and that's how the Donald Trump administration has, it's basically in Area 51, floor 42 in Area 51, look it up, floor 42 in Area 51, that, that's where the tech is. They have one of four looking glasses that en yeah. enables a person to look into the past and future. I heard about something on a different floor. Area 51, they have technology, like weapon technology. If you guys look up the, there's a, there's a, even right now, you guys, if I tell you right now, oh, do you know that lightsabers exist? They do exist. They have the, they have the, like beams of light that are, they burn through paper. Plastic, anything, but it doesn't come to a point like a lightsaber though. It just keeps going. Like, but if you uh, look up the look up the, it's called like burn through beam or something like that. Burn through um, uh, laser. 